Brother of the man killed in a deadly Mother's Day shooting is demanding an end to gun violence. WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones is joining us from Pritchard Police Headquarters. And Jeremy, his brother tells you he tried to warn his brother before going to the club that night. That's right, Cherish. I spoke with Marquise Blevins, who did warn his brother. Not only does he want the person who committed the crime to be responsible for killing his brother, but also says the shooter who probably did do this crime was someone that his brother knew and. Get that for us too late. Get that for us too late, man. That's the message from Marquise Blevins pleading for change after his brother, Jaquel Graham, was killed last Sunday at the Gentleman's Club in Pritchard. Blevin says his brother was involved in a lot of criminal activity, but says it's never worth it. The streets are for nobody. Like, the street people that's out there, man, it might ain't worth it. You look at the long run. I was with my brother the night before he died. You know, I told him don't go to that club. Most of this is beef, street beef. Homeboys growed up together, now we enemies. Pritchard investigators say two other people were injured in the shooting, Investigators also say they are unsure how someone brought the gun inside the club, even though there was security. Blevins believes the shooting was a setup. It's a revolving door. Jail, or you're going to die, man. It's, it's, it's a revolving door. Instead of picking up drugs, man, go get you a job. Try to be something first. Try to be something first. Stand for something. You see, we come from nothing. We ain't doing nothing but killing each other. Blevins hopes his brother's story can help deter others from criminal activity. He says his brother and most of his good friends were lost to street violence. My brother Jock Will, you know, he probably lived his life the way, you know, other people didn't approve, but all that was betrayal. You know, friends killing friends. Ain't no stranger gonna do nothing to you. Sometimes, man, it is best to be by yourself. So my condolences go out to both of the Davis families. Joe Johnson, Corey Davis, my brother Jock Will Graham. All that was lost to street violence. And I want everybody to take this as a stepping stone to know, hey, get out for it's too late. We did reach back out to the Pritchard Police Department for an update on this shooting. We are waiting to hear back. Reporting live at Pritchard, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.